Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we are gonna learn about connected components. The name is connected components, but we can call this also connected pixels. Uh, connected similar pixels also we I can call this function this very useful and is taking some parameters here which is the image input which is the labels gives us the output connectivity type we are gonna learn in the code part more detailly and this is a, the uh, type of the labels output type for one of them can be 32 signed or 60 16 unsigned uh, you can more learn about these types in my uh, math, math types video please check it and this is the type of the some of the uh, methods which is gonna use to find the connected components okay let's pass to the code part directly in here i already have an input and let's apply this function to this input first of all uh, in here there is is saying egg be single channel image to be labeled and it's uh, suggested to this uh, input image to be thresholded I don't need to threshold because it's already white and black you can see this is already white and black and I don't need to uh, make it uh, apply threshold again so I can directly call my uh, connected components function well, which is I'm gonna use the second overloaded one first of all which is the easy one and here I'm gonna give the input then I'm gonna give the labels which I need here not labels okay let's give this as output and after that connectivity type for or act we can give we can understand after see the results about this and let's give this for now act then done the others is just the uh, the others is just The others just is the default one labels already defined here okay and what is next after that we already get this one but this function gives us the output also what is that is the output in here integer output computes this connected components labeled image of boolean image so uh, in here it directly gives us the its return type is the how many component that image includes so number of component maybe we can call that and we can print it to the console after that okay then we can directly see the results first of all okay it's written seven so let's count this is the first component this is the second uh, component and this is the third one fourth five sixth and where is the seventh one? Seventh one is the background. This is also a uh, pixels component to each other. What I mean by component, for example, if you zoom, this pixel is connected to this one, this one, and this one connected to this one, this one, until it uh, reaches to the borders. These are all is comp uh, connected to each other. So we are uh, counting this one, two, three, four, five, six, and as the background seven. And it gives us the output as 7 okay but it also gives us uh, help us to differentiate these components for example uh, it's labeling and this is just one and all of these pixels I already have as label how it works let's see uh, first of all these labels maybe it's better uh, to create some colors to differentiate each of them how it's labeling for that maybe I need to create a vector color vector and it's gonna be vector 3b after that this is gonna be colors uh, colors 0 by the way always is the background in here also it's friend 0 represent the background label so label 0 is gonna be the uh, background so we can make it equalize to labels zero and uh, not like this sorry we can make it black okay then for each label not each label but each component we can put different random colors for example it starts from i is equal to zero smaller than comp and I plus plus 
Then colors i is equal to cv vector 3b. Okay. Then just gonna put some vector type randomly. For example, random. Okay. And the second one is gonna be same. Copy. Okay. And already I assigned for each uh, component different color. Then let's use them. First of all, we need to uh, check each of the pixel in the image. First of all, maybe we need to create another image for output. Let's make it name out and create all zeros. Size is totally equal to image size. And since we make it colorful, let's make it three channel. And I'm gonna draw the result inside this and the output. Let's put here our out im show and the image is out also. <sighs> Why it gives error because of this? Okay, let's make it now. I'm gonna check each of the pixels in the image and it's gonna be calls columns and it's gonna be also rows let's make it j okay then now i checking at all, all of them now i need to make it label how to do that each of label are uh, inside this label for each pixels it's representing different so it looks like mapping to understand this maybe you can check remap video how it's mapping how it's labeling very similar to the remap function so in here just uh, for each pixels it has a label let's check it uh, for example if uh, labels at since it's signed let's convert to the integer and the point i to the g and if it is not equal to zero if it is equal to zero it's background if it's not equal to zero it's another label so in out i can change it okay out dot add since it's three channel vector 3b and cv point i to the g and it's equal to which we already defined above colors uh, colors this one but it's gonna be integer so i need to casting and since it's done i think so let's see the result ah sorry maybe here something wrong um Okay, this is seems okay. Integer uh, in here I already defined for each of the component. I already defined and labels is cause of this or cause of something else. Cause of something else. What is wrong? Um, maybe because of this. Why it crashes? Mm. okay it's maybe because of ah because of i didn't make the size size gonna be like this i think it's because of that yeah now it's gonna work i hope yeah now done now you can see we already have seven in here seven components and each of them is different color so not only it gives us the output number of output components which is the pixel connected to each other until reaches to different uh, kind of index value it gives us output and uh, it also gives which pixel belongs to which component so it's very useful in this way but what about this connectivity this is eight but what does it mean to understand that maybe it's better to give some uh, example for example input image at uh, sorry image dot 
at uh, since it's grayscale we can use unsigned char and in point 33 to 33 let's make white and its corner let's make 34 to 34 now see the number of components it's x now in here you can you are gonna see here I define two and it's counting this as one one is that one is background two three four five six seven eight so the number of component is eight but if you make this four it's gonna be nine why it's like that because it's a uh, four-way connectivity you see it also it's different color eight means one two three four five six seven eight so the eight way connectivity means that if you use four it will not um, in, it will not consider these two pixel as connected so you need to put eight if you wanna to count that as connected you need to use eight that's the connectivity type uh, this is overloaded I am not gonna talk about detail with this uh, type of the math type if you are curious you can check these three types just wanted to talk to you about this function in this video and I'm done for now see you in the next videos